So we're just outside of Gorham, New Hampshire this morning, the Appalachian Trailhead. We're gonna head up Valley Way, trying to get Madison and Adams this morning. Uh, for me, sort of a, a fun one. This would complete number 47 and 48 uh, for me and my, sort of my first go through, I guess, of the, a lot of these hikes in New Hampshire. So I'm excited to get this one going. Pretty cold. Just the weather we're gonna be dealing with today, about uh, 30 down below. It's gonna be about negative three up top. Oh, that was about 10 miles, that was 10 miles per hour of wind is the, I guess what to expect. So here we go. Couple miles up Valley Way, got about 1,500 feet of elevation so far. So I feel like we really haven't even got to the steep parts of this yet. So we're just trucking along, nice and wide out here. So some of these steeper hikes, I am definitely not the fast one. As you can see, the team I'm with is completely out of sight. I usually average about two miles an hour try to keep it right around that pace so especially on the a lot of this incline so I'm definitely not ever the fastest one in the group but that's okay it's good to know your pace and there's always going to be somebody who can do it better than you can So I can see why this hike surprises a lot of people or can surprise someone. I think we're, she's four, four miles in and we've already done 3,300 feet of elevation. We still got a while to go to get up to the hut. So uh, it's definitely a push uh, going up Valley Way for sure. So just sort of gonna keep slogging and hopefully be there sooner rather than later. You know, look up at Madison from here for a sort of shot where we're headed. Right up to the top. Great shots of undercast up here. It's awesome. Good shot of Washi, Washington too. Straight up ahead. You can see the auto road too, going up to the top. So this big one over here is one of the Adams. I don't know which one, I have to look on my map. But we're pretty close to Madison right now. Almost there. having a day above the clouds both sides I'm gonna scoot you back over to here it's a while top of Madison
just left Madison Hut. Now we got a pretty, I'd say that's a pretty steep incline up to Adams about a mile away. And that'll be the last for today. So we chose to go Star Lake up to Adams. Uh, sort of looks like it's the road less traveled. So just post holding a couple spots here and there, but hopefully this doesn't get too much worse than what I'm doing already. Cause as everyone knows, post holing is no fun. Going up to the top of that. So we can look back across the Madison. That's where we came from. Might be able to see Star Lake down there. It's all frozen over. And almost up to Adams. I must say this coming up this boulder field is not easy. Uh, hard to talk because my face is so frozen, but we're, we're almost up there. So we are back under a tree line, not dealing with the weather anymore. Um, my battery keeps dying on my GoPro, so I'm probably gonna have to finish this up later and not at the end of this hike. But uh, I've got about two and a half miles left. All right, so made it to the end of Adams and Madison. Um, I will wrap this one up a little later just because my GoPro is having some issues with the battery and the coldness apparently if it's super cold the GoPro does not work well so back home now apparently the GoPro in super chilly weather does not uh, work as planned I think it could have been partially my fault though keeping the my spare battery I had on sort of the outside of my pack so maybe the, the battery was a little bit cold so I wasn't able to to get some footage on the hike yesterday, but that's okay. I still got plenty. So it's now the next day, uh, sort of looking back uh, on that specific hike going up to Madison via Valley Way and then up to Adams. Uh, we did Star Lake, which was really interesting. And then we took the airline back down Adams all the way uh, back down to Appalachia. We had sort of planned a different route, but the, the wind was just so brutal uh, at, um, at the top of Adams. It was just really cold, had to be with the wind chill. I don't know what the temperature was, but it was well below zero. And I think that was part of the issue uh, with the battery on my GoPro as well. So that's a that's a unforgiving hike. You do 4,000 feet of elevation uh, from the beginning of Appalachia going up Valley Way to the top of Madison. Um, the making it up to Madison Hut sort of a nice little uh, relief for just a very short period of time before you go up to Madison but uh, coming back down Madison to the hut and then having to go another 1100 feet up to Adams is uh, it's it's not easy I mean for me I was really tired and that that uh, face going up Star Lake is really steep 
and I just I was so slow going up that but it was great to get up there to the top and for me that was number 48 so I was had a sense of accomplishment it was really great to be up there um, you know especially with the the people that I've done a lot of these hikes with uh, and, and having their support and coming out for this one was just wonderful so in all that's that's a challenging one if you go out and do that one just take your time it's uh, definitely as I mentioned unforgiving so uh, to, to wrap up I think it was 9 to 10 miles and about 5,000 feet of ele- well over 5,000 feet of elevation coming back down Madis- Madison and then back up Adams so it's it's a lot of work but super worth it and we really lucked out with the views yesterday and all that undercast that's in the in the video just wonderful so as always thanks again and uh until next time